Hey guys, I hope all is well with everyone. So, this one here, we're going to be looking into J Hope and Tae Young's energies. I will have timestamps down below. Um, we're going to start off with looking at their feelings towards each other. Who's J Hope's and Tae Young's feelings towards each other? Their current feelings towards each other. The current feelings towards J Hope and Tae Young, please. Well, it looks like taking necessary steps because we have Ace and then two here of the swords. Somebody's seeing truth here of an action. Maybe even a decision that was taken on Tae Young's part here. And became stressful. Tell us more, please. The current feelings between Tae Young and J Hope, please. A lot of swords, so being very stuck in the mind here. Some sort of action had created them to feel stuck and bound here with the world. Maybe even having to close out a cycle here. It's like defeating this decision that was made. I was like looking very closely at their situation. This There's a cup here that they're taking down and examining. Looking further into it, there's some sort of valuableness to it. Probably even their legacy. Finding justice within something that was kept from them with their creative contract. And they're trying to revive happiness within the situation here with what was kept from them why do we have this five of pentacles here Why do we have this Five of Pentacles? They're balancing out some sort of issue with their career. Asking about those pentacles, we have a total of four pentacle cards. Along with a Virgo energy card. So really having to do with their career. They're discussing on what they're holding on tight to. They want to balance things out because they really enjoy what they do. But with what? The things are that's kept from them. It's almost like it's deteriorating this love energy with what they do. But they don't want to let go of it. 
they really enjoy with what they do. It's almost like somebody who's a fire sign here that surrounds them is creating an issue. It's like almost like behind their back. They revive these swords as being stabbed in their back. It's a dedicated helping hand. So somebody who really helps them out is really hurting them. And it's almost like they're trying to figure out how to defeat this issue with his king of wands. It's almost like the more they do with this person, the worse things get. So they're trying to figure out a way around this situation. How to prevent this from continuing, continuously happening. Alrighty, so next we're going to be asking about J Hope's true thoughts about Tay Young. Can you tell us about J Hope's true thoughts on Tay Young, please? J Hope's true thoughts about Tay Young, please. J Hope's true thoughts on Tay Young, please. He sees him as a calling, somebody to go to, to talk, to talk to, to socialize about things that he he learned on his career path. He feels comfortable talking to Tae Young about different ways to transition through doors, finding healing through situations very quickly, and being able to find control and authority through it. Wherever he feels like he doesn't have control, he finds it very easy to go to Tae Young to revive the feeling of having authority and being able to have control over any situation. The Seven Eight of Cups helps him continue on with his path, examine situations, and leave behind what no longer serves. It's like helping J-Hope to realize the things that he's holding on tight to are unnecessary to hold on tight to. Helps him find a way to release what no longer serves him, what doesn't really serve him, and he thinks it does. It's almost like Young helps him overcome an illusion when J-Hope feels like he's lost control of a situation that he's not able to show his own authority through it. All 
Alrighty, so next we have Young's True Thoughts about J-Hope, please. What does Young truly think about J-Hope? Young's True Thoughts about J-Hope, please. <clears throat> so, he sees J-Hope dealing with a lot, I'm hearing dark issues, um, strong battles and conflicts that's attached to his Wheel of Fortune. It's almost like he feels uneasy about J-Hope's situations. He wants him to see him have success and happiness. But it's almost tricky for J-Hope to receive happiness and winds up running into disappointment. It's like Young wants him, yeah, he wants him to be able to fill his cup up with happiness and joy, hope. Definitely dealing with third party involvement between them. So he's giving him helping advice, helpful hand wherever he can here with the Five of Pentacles in the dark, but though moving forward. Like taking actually taking necessary steps to continue this path. So he wants things to change for J-Hope, but he can only do so much. So he's providing a helping hand with where he can with J-Hope's strong issues that he's dealing with. Physical issues, projects probably even. Being very patient about the project and looking further into it. Trying to be very nurturing about it. Almost like sympathetic. Trying to give a helping hand to be graceful with moving this Wheel of Fortune very carefully. I'm hearing meticulous. But socializing about a third party issue. Am I even talking about things that are nostalgic? Things from the past. I'm trying to be able to see the situation from another perspective. It's almost like Tae Young's giving him advice. He's trying to. Even some type of helping hand with where and how he can. Even if it's just words. With this Three of Cups. Definitely a close energy with each other. Yeah. It's like trying to refill up his cup up with fill um J Hope's cup with happiness and joy, some form of hope. 
of defeating these battles, these conflicts. They're involved with his Wheel of Fortune. It's almost like Young's trying to help him in a, a very careful way. Like he's not, he's trying not to get caught by helping him. So anyways, that's where I'm going to leave this one off at. If you found yourself enjoying, please do me a favor, hit that like button, share, comment, subscribe. Until next time, you guys, off you to Zane. Bye-bye.